What's up, y'all? It's Luke at Galatas, and uh, today we're going to be talking about the uh, proper boot fit, specifically Western boots, is what we're going to be talking about today. And we're going to be talking about the kind of the three main things you need to look for whenever you're looking for a proper boot fit. First thing is going to be the instep, the top of your foot, how that fits in your boot, very important. Second thing is going to be the width or the ball of your foot area. The third thing is going to be the heel and how much slip you need and all that kind of stuff. And then we're going to give you the secret, that uh, kind of secret ingredient to a proper boot fit. I pulled a couple boots here today that I'm going to try on just so you can maybe give you a little bit of a, a visual on what proper boot fit looks like or improper depending on, on the boot here. So let's try, let's try one out here. This is t my typical size. This is a nine and a half. Now there's different widths in Western boots and uh, in pretty much all boots. And your typical regular width, a normal width, is going to be indicated by a D width. You may see it in here. It says nine and a half D right in this area. And a wide width would be a double E. It's usually just D and double E. So those are the, the two main widths that we're looking for. So this is a nine and a half D. I'm gonna put my foot in here and what you want is a little bit of resistance right here now that my heel is up here you can see there's a little bit of resistance and what you're looking for is that pop you heard that the snap so this is a really good fit it fits me very well nine and a half D and you can see right across the top in the instep area the instep is the top of your foot right here so the first thing we look for is proper instep fit there's no slack in here as you can see, it's holding it down, holding my foot in there. That's what's going to keep your foot in place. In a Western boot, you don't have laces, so you don't, you can't tighten it up. If it doesn't fit, it doesn't fit. So very important in step. The second thing is going to be the width of the uh, of the boot or your foot, and that's the ball area of your foot right here. The the widest part is also where your foot flexes. So you want to make sure you have enough room in there. So in step needs to be not tight, not loose but snug. So instep, snug, width, you need to have enough room in there. You don't want that tight either, but if you have a little bit of play in the width of the boot, that's still fine because your foot's not going anywhere. The instep is holding you in, right? Because you have a snug instep. The third thing you need is the heel slip. Now, I mean, you can't see this, I know, so it's kind of hard to, um, what do you call it? Illustrate uh, while I'm wearing it here, but whenever you step right here, this part of the, of the step here, your heel should come up a little bit. Now the, the kind of agreed upon amount of a new boot that you want to slip is like a three-eighths of an inch which is, is probably hard to remember but it's somewhere between you know a quarter and a half inch. And it's gonna be different with every boot but that's try to remember a quarter a half inch. You want a little bit of slip when you take a step. The reason for that is when a boot is new the sole is a little stiff and a boot that you break in is gonna be way more flexible. You can see whenever I step that boot wants to come up really easily. With a new boot, this one is actually pretty flexible from the get-go, but it doesn't flex as much, not as easily, so it wants to pull down, and that's what's going to make you have that heel slip. So, that one there, let's just kind of illustrate it again. Different boot. Boom, pops right in there. Fits pretty well. Not a whole lot of slack here. This one has a little bit more, and different skins kind of feel a little different, but you want that. It's very important right across this area here. You don't have a whole lot of play. And that's good, that's a good fit. Let's try another one here. Now this one, you see all this slack here? I don't know if you can see the play. This is a really soft leather boot. A lot of play in here. This is not good. This, this is gonna mean whenever my heel comes up like that, I can feel my heel slipping out over a half. I mean, it's, it's coming out. You can see I can just take that boot off super easy. That's not good, that's too big. Let's go with this one. Sometimes you have you want to get into the pull straps. You would pulling up on it. Also, you're stepping into the boot, putting your weight into it that way. If it's a boot that has a, a tire throat on it, boom, pops in there. Very good fit. I know this might seem a little redundant, but you can see everything kind of they all fit a little bit different. But right across here, instep, very important. I have enough room in here, and just a little bit of heel slip when I take a step good fit. Let's try another one. Tin Hall. Really cool boot. Fits my foot very well. In step. 
snug, right? Width, you have ample room, enough room, and a little bit of heel slip. Those are the three things, man. The three pillars, if you can get that on a boot fit, you're gonna enjoy your boots. Interesting note here <clears throat> is every brand is different. Every, sometimes within a brand, you're gonna wear different sizes. So you saw that all these boots fit me. Let's see what size they are. This is a nine and a half D. This is a nine and a half D. This is a nine and a half double E. That's a wide. Nine and a half D. This is a 10 D. And let's try this one. 10 D also. Fits me well. So, wearing a bunch of different sizes. I actually have a pair of boots at home. That is a 10 double E and another one that is a 9 double E. So I'm, I'm all over the place with sizes. All those boots fit me very well. So three things to remember. What are they? First thing, instep, that you, if it's snug, because that's what's holding you in the boot. Number one is instep. Number two is the width. Number three is the heel. The heel, you want just a little bit of slip, quarter inch, something like that. The big secret here to make sure that you're checking the box on that's going to ensure you have a great fit is make sure it feels good on you so don't let anybody tell you this boot is your size you know it doesn't matter it doesn't matter what the number is stamped in the boot try it on and that's what we do here at galatas we don't try to force you into a certain size you're going to come in we're going to say, you're going to say i'm a nine and a half double e you're going to say great here's nine and a half double e try it on you know what, it's a little too big? Here, try, try a 9.5D. And then we, we're gonna fit you in the right thing. And it's, we're gonna walk you through all the three pillars of, uh, of boot fit, which we all know around here. And uh, we're gonna try to get you in something that actually works for 